My name is Asimina Kyurti. I'm an assistant professor in the Department of Electrical and Computer Engineering at The Ohio State University. We're in the Electroscience Lab. My group is working on wearable and implantable technologies, meaning antennas and wireless technologies that are in close proximity to the human body. We have been using electromagnetics in our day-to-day -day lives for decades now. We have microwave ovens in our homes. We're using cell phones on a daily basis. Several of us are wearing smartwatches with wireless capabilities. So the question is, how can we leverage these wireless capabilities into our day-to-day -day lives? We're developing a new technology. We're embroidering threads directly on fabrics. Uh, you see here an example of a spiral antenna. This can be used as an antenna itself, meaning you can have all sorts of sensors and you can have a large footprint antenna directly embroidered on the clothes or on any kind of fabrics to transmit this information wirelessly and far away. Some examples are shown here, placed directly on the body. What you see here is silver, but you can actually integrate color to have something that's much more seamless. It all started with antennas like this. We're moving now forward with actual sensors, like having garments that monitor the motion of the human body. And besides wearables, we're expanding to the area of implants as well. Let's say you wear a smart hat and that one communicates with the implant underneath. Now this idea will work, however tissues are typically very lossy, so they'll consume or absorb a lot of the power. So very recently we have been developing a new class of antennas, which is uh, an example prototype is shown here. The idea is to have a wearable antenna that mimics the tissues. In doing so, we have been able to uh, exceed the state-of-the-art efficiencies by 25 times at the moment and we keep building on it. So on one side having uh, wearables that are directly integrated in the fabric, on the other side uh, small seamless and wireless implants, ideally without batteries, and transform the lives of people in any way we can imagine right now. That includes all of us, it includes athletes, it includes people in the military, uh, it includes children that may need monitoring. So I see EM and wireless sensors on the body or inside the body transforming the way we think and monitor our performance on a day-to-day -day basis in the future.